Hello, friends. Hey. Welcome back to the our kitchen. bar. Woo. <laughs> uh, we are here making another Disney cocktail because what else do we have to do but drink during Happy quarantine? quarantine. Uh, so today we are making the ever delicious African, African margarita from the Dawa Bar in the Animal Kingdom. Mm -hmm. It's very easy to make. We did have to do a slight substitution. Um, we don't have the Vanderhum or Vanderhum uh, tangerine liqueur, so we're just going to use orange curacao, which I looked up and is should be pretty similar. So we'll let you know how it goes. I feel like sometimes that's in margaritas anyway, so yeah, should be delish. Yay! So here we've got our orange curacao. Simple syrup. That syrup is so simple. Which you can actually make yourself. Um, it's just like sugar and water. You just need to heat it up. We got espalon, but you can use any kind of um, tequila, white tequila, silver tequila, um, and then sweet and sour mix. So again, any kind. You can. I think you can also make your own sweet and sour. <coughs> and a lime. Ta-da! Also. I just smelled this stuff, the sweet and sour mix, mm -hmm. which we'll see. We got Mr. and Mrs. T. <laughs> By Penny the Fool and his wife. I smelled the sweet and sour mix, and it definitely smells like yellow Gatorade. Yay! My favorite. Yum. So first thing, a little ice. Smooth. Is this too much? Never too much. Nice to meet you. Uh, we're going to be using just a standard shot glass um, for this recipe. Sorry, now it's not focusing again because the dog walked into the picture. Hi, dog. Hi, Aria. Hi, dog. <laughs> Hi, dog. Unnamed dog. That two parts tequila. Mm -mm. All right, that's a lot of alcohol. There's a lot of booze in this, kids. One part. Commander Hume. Or Orange Carousel. In this carousel. case, Orange Carousel. Mmm, <laughs> I can smell the tequila from here. It's a nice mix. Mmm! Kind of looks like a light iced tea. Yeah. Or like Coke that's been sitting too long. Like way too long. Like you, you had never like had a that sip of coke in and the then left it for like a day. Yeah. yeah, but that's what I mean. Way too long. Yeah. One part simple syrup. It is very simple. I think that cuts the tequila a little bit. The sweetness. Yeah. Look at that. See, this is actually a substantial drink, unlike the hippopotamai tie we made last time. Two shots of rum. For nothing. That was it. Two shots of rum and nothing else. And then two parts. Sweet and sour. Sweet and sour. Yellow Gatorade. <laughs> Don't use yellow Gatorade. You could try it. Let us know how it turns out, but we yeah. will not be doing that. Look at that. And it also says to use one juice, uh, juice from one lime, but I am... We only have one lime left. So we're gonna use half of the lime, which is fine. I think that's honestly plenty. They don't do this with a salt rim there, do they? I don't believe so. Yeah, I don't think so either. I remember we just got in like a plastic cup. Yeah, but I bet you could do one and it would be tasty. I'm sure it would. Just put some salt on your hand and lick it off. <laughs> it does the same thing. You see salt though. All right. Look at these bad boys. Now we don't have a swizzle sticky. So, so we're using a knife. Let me use the knife I used to cut the lime. Woo! Look at that. And you can see the difference nice, because on stir. this one, all the alcohol's at the bottom. Yeah, let's give you a nice you don't want. shot. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, look at the difference between these two. Crazy. <laughs> yeah. It looks pretty, but I mean, swirl? that would be real alcoholic. Yeah. At the bottom. That's nice. You could also use a shaker, I'm sure. Hmm. We don't come well equipped in this house. <laughs> no. Alrighty. Here we go. 
Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Ooh. That's good. That's it's pretty close. That's pretty close. Yeah, it's a little sweet. Yeah, I remember not being as sweet, but I was also hungry, thirsty, and warm. So who knows? Yeah. But, mmm. Yeah, maybe do like a little less simple syrup. Yeah. Just a tiny bit. Yeah, just a little under a shot. Dude, other mm. than that, though, it's really good. That really is. And the maybe spot. the full lime would have been better, too. Yeah. Giving it a little bit more of that sour flavor but, um, that it needs. But I would definitely do a salt rim with this, too. I might. Yeah, I bet it could taste delicious. I might do a little salt a little lick. Salt lick. <laughs> That's hot. <laughs> But yeah, th I think this is one of the better ones we've made. The f the first Dole Whip Froscato we made was delicious too. Yeah. Um, and We found the key with that is definitely use the coconut milk. Yeah. We've made it a few times without or trying and to substitute. And it's not the same. And you ha uh, the Dole Pineapple definitely tastes better. The Stop and Chop one wasn't as good. Um, yeah. But yeah, so this one's a good one. Definitely a keeper. I have made this before. But I did find a different, I think it was like a... It wasn't a tangerine liqueur. It was some mm -hmm. other type of orange um, citrus variety. It wasn't orange curacao, though. But I don't know. I it like still, this It still works. I yeah. think it works. I'm sure the tangerine gives it a different sweetness, but mm -hmm. definitely a keeper. Yeah. You can't taste the tequila that much. No, and it looked like a lot. So. Hey, cheers <laughs> to that. So let us know what Disney drinks you're making. Yeah, let us know. Uh, do you prefer... Tequila, we've done one with rum, one with vodka. Maybe we'll find one with gin. I don't know if one exists that we'll I've had. Look. We'll have to look it up because that's my favorite We love alcohol. gin in this house. And I don't know what else we have. We have some bourbon. You can see if there's any bourbon stuff. Oh, I definitely think there is. So. I would like to recreate the sangria from Mexico during food Ooh, and wine next. That's a favorite of mine. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, let us know if there's one that you'd like us to try out for you, be it the guinea pigs, before <laughs> you go ahead and buy all the alcohol for it, because it mm. gets expensive. It can. Um, or, yeah. Try this out and let us know how it goes. Absolutely. Cheers, everyone. Cheers. Okay, peeps. I'm... All right, I'm back to tell you that I made my own little salt rim, and... That's it. That's what it needed. <laughs> so if you like salt, go for it. And also, I will link the recipe that we have down below. It goes by parts, which means just like equal amounts. Whether you use tablespoons, shot glasses, cups, I won't jigger. judge. A jigger, those things are great too. I need to get me one of those. We are starting to have our own little bar collection here. But um, yeah, party through the parks. Uh, the blog has a bunch of the Dawa bar recipes, so... There you go. Cheers again. Do the salt rim. You won't regret it. Tequila!